just a few moments. One guy who's been getting it done so far, Stephen Curry. And in terms of points in that first half, you know, he's now at a point where we expect him to perform that way. And Greg, that tells you all you need to know about what a talent he is. I mean, I'll bet he adds a lot more to his totals after the break. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the second half of basketball. And Golden State looking at who they've got. We've got Rush. Maurice Spades out there with Green. Then it's Curry. And it's Clark in a, the shooting guard position. Wow, fired that bounce pass in there beautifully. To the middle. From inside. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Clark's got five points so far. And, and that's the kind of lead pass we've come to expect from him. Carter Williams with it. And Curry picks him up defensively. Here's Monroe. And it is flushed down with a nice jam. And if that doesn't get them fired up, guys, nothing will. Greg, just what the doctor ordered, huh? Some high-flying annex to narrow the deficit. Tell you what, fellas, that could give them the energy boost they've been looking for. There you go, fans. Now the door. Rock Spencer. One more time. Let him hear it. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Curry kicks to Rush. Wide open. And there's Stephen Curry on the assist by Rush. And that's now 10 points for Steph Curry. They're doing work here in the second half. Three or four to start. Timeout called the Bucks. Bucks trail by nine. Carter Williams dishes to Monroe. Takes it up with both hands and rips it down. Cutting into that lead a little bit. Way to finish. And the basket is still shaking. Oh, I mean, he has got power in bunches on that two hand. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Chris Middleton. That is his first foul of the game. Different look here for the Warriors. Andrew Bogan, he's checked in for Spates. Harrison Barnes comes in for Draymond Green. Andre Iguodala is checked in for Brandon Rush. And it's Thompson in for Ian Clark. The Warriors shooting their sixth and seventh free throw attempts tonight. And it's been an average year, really, at the free throw line for this group, only around 75%. And, and guys, you know what? That's made things hard for them in a lot of their games. I mean, that inability to convert their chances at the free throw line. Now here's Carter Williams. He's got 10. Up off the screen. And scoring with the play inside is Parker. Stolen by Monroe. Middleton drives in. It's out of the Kumbo on the wing. Here's Carter Williams. Banked in off the glass. Now just a five-point warrior lead. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. I tell you, we're taking a look at some real deficiencies defensively. I mean, they've given up five straight good looks in the paint. Now here's Iguodala. Taking a look at his stance, he's averaging around seven and a half points a game. Well defended that time. He's a shooter that the defense has to close down on quickly when he's ready to pull that trigger. You've got to be in his face and not give him any space. And you can see, Clark, that he has garnered the attention of the defense here. They are not going to allow him to get those kinds of looks. Misses from close range. Guys, uh, they've been getting it done. They sure have been. I mean, really looking good and sharp offensively. They came out with a mission, and they have been tough to stop. Boy, you got to love it. The picture-perfect alley-oop. A little surprise, though, Clark. He didn't go for the big slam, but it works just the same. Counts for two. Yeah, it does. Almost makes it a little more special, though, when you can have a little bit of grace as opposed to just the full Monty with the power. It's stolen by Carter Williams. 
And the rejection by Adetokounmpo. And they get it back. Here's Curry with the three. Can't get it to go. Great D that time for Middleton. One oh seven left to play in the third. And Craig Monroe with the slam. And guys, right now, the defense mentally not there. Can't afford too many of those in a close game like this. Yeah, Jay, you're right. Almost a free run, don't you think? Clark to the hoop for him there. Momentum can swing on plays like that, Kevin, especially when the finish has that much thunder on it. Parker. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Parker's got six. And you talk about fighting your way back into a game. They've shown a lot of grit in this comeback. They sure did, Greg. And I like the fact they never put their chin in their chest when they were down early. I mean, they were down big early. They were composed, and they never got desperate and stayed within themselves. Very impressive. The shooting numbers just aren't there yet in the quarter. Middleton the pass to Onda Takubo. Monroe, left side. And lots of contact there. Missing the shot. He'll shoot two. That's on Andrew Bogut. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. The Bucks have made three of five free throw attempts. Both teams will make substitutions. So he gets them both. Livingston. We're at the end. All right, we welcome you back to what's been a hard-fought battle. Fourth quarter should be good. Milwaukee leading by three. Ennis out there with Vaughn. Then it's Mayo. Then it's John Henson, and it's O'Brien in at the fourth. That's the five on the floor for the Bucks. Here's O'Brien. Henson with the screen. Ennis kicks to Henson. It's good, the assist that time for Ennis. Henson's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for the Bucks and did not seem happy about how things are going on right now and maybe wants to make some changes. I agree. I mean, this was not comfortable with the way things were set up at that particular time. And in that case, I think it's the right thing to do. A moment to check in with Doris Burke. Doris? Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Steve Kerr was saying to the team. He told his guys, listen, we've got to make the most of every opportunity right now. We can win this game, but it's all about making every single possession count. Guys, we'll see if they can come back. And thank you, Doris. Hey, listen, they're still right in this thing. Missing that free throw, though, keeps this a two-possession deficit. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. Boy, he threw out some punishment with that two-hand throwdown. And, and Clark, now's the time to do it. Continue to attack that rim. Warriors trail by six. Out to the right wing. It's rush outside. And Henson pulls it down. I I'd love to see them impose themselves a little more on the backboard. That's a great way to find confidence. Always a surefire way to get back in the game. Well, guys, they need to do something to reduce this deficit. So we'll see if that's the answer. And some changes here for the Bucks. Jabari Parker's checked in for Johnny O'Brien. On his under to Kumbo comes in. And Michael Carter Williams subbed in for Ennis. And then for Golden State. Andrew Bogut checked in for Spates. Clay Thompson comes in for Ian Clark. And Steph Curry subbed in for Sean Livingston. Here's Parker. The shot no good. Warriors shoot 43% from the floor. Green dishes to Bogut. Thompson again. It's Carter Williams. And the foul on John Henson. That'll be his second foul of the game. 
Andre Igudawa has checked in for Brandon Rush. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. Bucks leading by six. In the corner, Mayo with it. Raymond Green with the rebound. Green's got four rebounds in this game. The drive by Thompson. And Henson sends it back. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Outside, Mayo. Ring shot on the way. Perfect on the shot. Swishes it through. And the Bucks lead by eight. And what's your take, guys, in the hustle stats for the Bucks? Their defense has been outstanding, closing out on shots and blocking a few as well. You know, adding on to that, we can't fail to mention all the steals they've piled up, too. I mean, that's making a big difference. They've really gotten into them defensively. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. The short rest very important, and one of the benefits of this part of the game is getting on the same page with your team while having the chance to hydrate with Gatorade. Replenish your energy for the late game push. Monroe's checking for Milwaukee. Now here's Adetokounmpo. The drive by Monroe. Not surprised at all. He's shooting it well and scoring points in bunches. Warriors trail by seven. Curry pass to Thompson. Passes it to Bogut. Back to Thompson. Soft touch off the glass. I mean, you never expect to get opportunities that easy coming down the stretch of a tight game. Carter Williams with it. And Monroe kicks to Honda Takuma. But he stays with it. Back to Monroe. Outside Mayo. It's stolen by Green. Down low. Here's Thompson. Good D by Parker. You know what? He's just stone cold right now. Really not sure if he's their best option offensively as they try to get back in this game. Solid, solid work on the back end of that play. Yeah, finish hard with two hands on the stuff. Yeah, nothing extravagant, guys, but again, no need on that one. From deep three-point range. And that's not the best of shot selection there. The defense definitely won that possession. Yeah, I think in that case, you've got to go elsewhere with the ball. You just can't rise up over the top of him when he's on you. Carter Williams dishes to Monroe. Back to Carter Williams. Stolen by Thompson. It's going to be tough for him here, but maybe, just maybe, it's not over yet. Cannot afford any empty possessions. They've got to recycle everything, partner. Oh, man, what a turnaround. Sensational play on D, and then the rapid-fire run to the basket. Craig, they didn't wait around, did they? They went right for the throat. Guys, this is crunch time now. When you've got a chance to capitalize on the turnover, you've got to take it and make it. Milwaukee making a switch here. Middleton's checked in. And really, with every point from this point on, it seems like they're just closer to finishing this one off. If they haven't already done it. I mean, hey, it's been a tremendous all-around performance from this group. I don't think there's any question about that. It's stolen by Curry. No good from Bogut. Time running low here. A quick score, Greg, and then probably foul him right away. That is just a careless turnover. You've got to be smarter in those exchanges. At the line for your bucks. Chris Who drops the first one, and that increases their lead to six. He's off on the free throw, unable to get that second one to drop in. It's Thompson off the drive. And again, it's the Warriors missing. Stolen by Thompson. Here's Green. Can't get it to fall. And so the Bucks take the win.
it was up for grabs right until the final seconds clock. You know what? They showed their character in crunch time, though, doing what had to be done to send these fans home happy. And that's going to do it.